gonna be going through my entire Poppy Playtime plush collection. And let me tell you, there is a lot of plush. I have one bag here, and then I have three massive bins full of plush. And we got a bunch of official plushies, and we also have some bootleg plushies as well. Starting off with the first one, it is the Boxy Boo plush. And this plush, guys, is huge. I mean, look at this guy. His arms and legs are so cool. I love what they did there. Looks just like from the game. It would be nice if like his head could kind of fit inside the actual box. This is a great looking plush. Next one here, we got another official one. Kissy Missy plush with the smile. Uh, the people that make these plushies over at Poppy Playtime, I think they do a phenomenal job. And of course, it's got the Velcro on the hands, so you can kind of attach Kissy Missy to whatever you want. Next up here, we got Bron the Dinosaur. And unfortunately, he tends to sit like this, but this is a bootleg plush. They actually have not made an official version of this plush yet. This is one of those rare circumstances where the bootleg actually looks really good. I mean, besides his weird neck spasm here. Next up, we got a bootleg Bunzo Bunny. I actually have a couple of these. The uh, little clapper things could be better. Again, really good looking plush. The, some of these bootleg companies have gotten really good with some of these plushies, but you're going to see pretty soon. They also do a pretty bad job at the same time. Next up, we got a Boxy Boo plushie. Obviously, this is a bootleg. This one does look far worse than the official one. The one thing I really don't like, I don't like his arms and legs. It's just like wrinkly. It's really weird. This is going to be a little bit of a fun comparison. We got an official Huggy Wuggy plush, and we have a bootleg Huggy Wuggy plush. I love the fur material on this one. I just, I think it looks great. Unfortunately, there's always just too much of it by the eyes, so it looks really weird. But um, this one also doesn't look bad, but if we're going for something that's more game accurate, of course this one's gonna be the one that wins. We got the official PJ Pug Up Pillar Plush. This guy is so cute looking. I love the fur here, looks great. I mean, they really nailed that face. We got an official Poppy Playtime Plush here. This actually came out of the plush mystery boxes. That's why she has a button for an I and an X, but um, they look really good for what they were going for with these plushies. Next up, we got another different official Huggy Wuggy plush, and honestly, I don't think this one looks very good. I mean, compared to some of the other official Huggy Wuggy plushies I've seen, honestly, I would kind of prefer the bootleg one that we saw earlier a little bit more. We got another official Huggy Wuggy plush, and this one is from a mystery plush box. I think this one looks really solid. I think the mouth on this one looks way better than the last one. We got the first ever official Poppy Playtime plush, and wow, did they nail this one. Love how it looks. We got the Kissy Missy plush. This is also from the plush mystery boxes. And again, I, I love how they did her mouth. I think it looks perfect. Perfect compared to the game. Next up, we got another official Huggy Wuggy plush. And again, not super crazy about this company that's making these. This is a different variant of a Huggy Wuggy plush. It looks very unique. I don't know what they were going for. It's kind of cool, but it's very different. Next up, we got another official Huggy Wuggy plush. I'm probably gonna get sick and tired of just saying that, but this guy looks phenomenal. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this. Next up, we got Baby Long Legs. This is a bootleg plushie, but it looks just like Baby Long Legs that we've seen. Next up, we got got the massive official mommy long legs plush. This thing is huge sitting right next to me. And I do love that with the legs, they added a wire into it. So you can kind of bend her legs and arms and hair any way that you'd want. We got two more official Huggy Wuggy and Kissy Missy plushies here. And again, you know, the, these don't hit the same as some of the other ones. We got another Kissy Missy plush from the mystery plush box. Boxes. And honestly, I don't know what it is about these ones, but something with the button eyes. I, I love that style. I think it looks really cool. Next up, we got the first ever official Kelly Willy plush. He looks great. He really does. Honestly, I was probably as shocked as anyone else that they even made this guy an official plushie. Next up, we got Cat B here, and she is wearing a Christmas hat. But honestly, this Cat B plushie looks really good, obviously. This is another bootleg. 
bootleg, but it is a very good looking bootleg. We also got Christmas Boogie Box. I wish it was a little smaller, but I mean, other than that, it's a decent looking bootleg. I know this one isn't a plushie, but it is an official product, and it is the Huggy Wuggy Halloween Basket. I bought this a while back, a couple years ago, and honestly, I don't know why I did. Next up, we got a Grinch version of Huggy Wuggy. This guy looks really cool. I love his Christmas hat and the little Playtime Co. bag. I love the concept of this plush. I think it's really good. Speaking of some really bad bootlegs, we got a Super Mario version of Huggy Wuggy. What on earth were they thinking? Next up, we got a Christmas bootleg poppy plushie. She looks really good, but she doesn't even come close to the official one. I don't even know what this thing is, but it was with the poppy playtime plushies. Speaking of Huggy Wuggy, we got them in so many different colors because they are also the Wacko Wuggies. We got a purple baby Huggy Wuggy, a really nice looking candy cat with a Christmas hat. I mean, I don't know what's going on with the tongue though, but a black star Huggy Wuggy, a bootleg kissy missy, and a bootleg purple Huggy Wuggy. We got one of the worst versions of Daddy Long Legs I think I've ever seen. We got a Kissy Missy really weird zipper pouch thing. I mean, look, her, her mouth opens up and you can see her teeth. And this is actually official, by the way. We got the gas mask from the Chapter 3 trailer. We got this thing. Oh, it's broken. A rainbow sparkle Huggy Wuggy, a sparkle blue and green Huggy Wuggy. I don't know what they were going with here. And right here, we got another bootleg, but this is actually the first version of PJ Pugapillar. This is actually what he was going to originally look like. We got a bootleg baby Huggy Wuggy and whoever this guy is. Now you see guys, the, the, some of these bootlegs are just horrible. This is a Pikachu Huggy Wuggy. We got a white version of Huggy Wuggy. We got another one of these things and these things are just so weird. <laughs> It's a little random, don't you think? We got more of these Huggy Wuggies in diapers. Like, I don't think I need to say anymore. We got another version of Daddy Long Legs here, and this one actually looks really good, especially for a bootleg. I mean, come on, guys. Looks just like the poster. We got another one of these. <laughs> We got a strange evil version of Huggy Wuggy, as if he wasn't already evil in the first place. We got Tiger Huggy Wuggy. No, I like it. I like the I like the tiger print. It's cool, but makes no sense. We got a Kissy Missy plush, and she's in a diaper. Zebra version of Huggy Wuggy that again doesn't look that bad, but it just doesn't make any sense. Speaking of what doesn't make any sense, a Mickey Mouse Huggy Wuggy. We got a rainbow of. Official Huggy Wuggy plush, which honestly kind of surprised me that they even made this. We got the official Daddy Long Legs plush, which honestly looks a lot like some of the bootleg. Uh, one of the bootleg Daddy Long Legs plushies that we've seen. Next up, we got the official Bunzo Bunny plush. One thing I really love about this guy is his little, I don't know what this is called, but they magnetically close together. So honestly, this. This guy is up there for one of my favorites. Next up, we got another official plush, which honestly kind of surprises me again. It's a baby Huggy Wuggy, and he has a removable pacifier. We got a cow version of Huggy Wuggy. You heard that right. A cow. You got any games on your phone? Next up, we got another bootleg of Bron the Dinosaur, but this one looks even better than the other one we saw. And guess what? His neck is normal. Now this official Special plush is really cool. It's a glow in the dark Huggy Wuggy plush. If I were to turn all the lights off, you'd glow in the dark. Next up, we got a bootleg version of PJ Pogapillar that actually looks fairly decent, but he doesn't look as good as the official one. I don't. I don't know, I'm not super crazy about this. And for the final plush, we have an official Mommy Long Legs plushie from one of the plush mystery boxes. Overall guys, out of all these plushies, this one has to be my favorite. It would have to be the official Huggy Wuggy plush. I'm just amazed on how good this plush looks. I mean, I think it looks great.
And as for my least favorite plush, well, I think there's too many to count. But alrighty guys, this is pretty much gonna wrap up today's video, and we'll catch you guys next time.